everyone so today I thought I'd do a little vlog for you because me and my boyfriend are moving out of this flat in when is it Thursday. Friday Thursday or Friday there he is the star of the show hiding there but yeah it's first well I think it's rainy Friday that we're moving so we have got a lot of stuff to pack <laughs> Um, but if you can see this room right now, I don't even know. Let's see if we can show you a little bit of it. It is an absolute tip and a half. So this is the room that I'm going to start with because it's got most of my stuff in there. I thought I'd do like a little moving vlog just to sort of like just show you me packing. Oh, that's not very good lighting. Just show me packing and getting ready to move out and all that jazz. I've got a bit of music going to try and help me get motivated got a bit of breaking benjamin i'm actually quite liking the new album even though it's sort of very similar to what they've done before but i quite like it i've got some curly whirlies as well to help me just uh <laughs> just um get a bit more motivated and i was laughing by the way because i hear my boyfriend laughing at me from the other room so yeah, so I'll take you along with me as I pack and stuff for the move. I have literally just packed I don't think the light will really be able to pick it up but all these clothes so I've got like a whole box of them where are you he's gone but yeah I've got like a whole box of clothes and I just need to like name them just to make sure that like because obviously there's some that like I've worn once and you know need to wash them or whatever but these are all like clothes that have been freshly washed that I probably won't need while I'm away so I'm just going to label them just to make sure that I know exactly what's in there so when it comes to opening them I know that they're fresh clothes I don't need to wash I think everyone will be able to reason me when like you know that you can't find the end of a <laughs> Nick thought I was talking to him but actually I was vlogging <laughs> So yeah, everyone will know the struggle when uh, you can't find the end of a parcel tape. Oh, so annoying. Okay, so I'm going to try and do this one-handedly, which could go awfully wrong, but we'll see. We'll totally see. So I'm trying to struggle to actually undo it. Oh, free pro. So here we go. Oh, we struggled. The absolute struggle with this. I've done it, I've got the end. Okay, so I'll put you somewhere while I wrap up the box. One box is now complete. Yes. Oh, there we go. Just done that. Hmm. Trying to think. Sorry, I keep going to like the really weird areas with literally like no light whatsoever. Ah, got like tape stuck to my finger. I'm trying to work out what to do next because there's it's really hard to like know what clothes I'm not going to need for the next two months because it could be sunny. It could be awful weather it could be in between so it's kind of hard to know which ones to maybe take home which ones to not so I'm sort of a bit struggling right now this is my wardrobe at the moment so uh yeah you can see how much left I've actually got to sort out but uh yeah hopefully hopefully it won't take too long and it should be fine 
Oh yeah. Unless they go into storage. I don't actually know what's in these uh, <laughs> bags, but. Uh, it's a big bag of crack. <laughs> it's not drugs. It's really not drugs. There's like loads of like, you know, socks and stuff in these bags, so I need to sort through them and just see what's in there. Just see if maybe I'll need some of the stuff on my way, but I doubt it. Annoying as well is. Because we're not moving into a house right away, we're sort of like trying to think like where to move to first before like moving because we're sort of unsure. <laughs> because, not gonna lie, we made a little bit of a mistake with this flat because it was too expensive and we thought oh, I'll be fine because it's in a really lovely location. But yeah, that, that didn't help in the end. So we're thinking about our move a little bit more strategically now and make sure that we get it right this time and hopefully find someone we can actually stay for a year or two instead of six months because I bloody hate moving so much. I hate it. There's still so much more to do but it's fine. It's fine. What we've done. So the time that we're spending thinking about where we're gonna live. Go on Nick, tell them. Adam Keys. <laughs> Adam Keys. Oh, not that true. Nick searching for some Alan oh, keys. Okay. Or Alan keys. Alan's keys. Alan's <laughs> Alan's keys. <laughs> Off he goes. Yay. I'm staying at my parents for a little bit and Nick's staying at his parents for a little bit just so we can sort of figure out where we want to move to next because honestly I really don't want to be like moving all the time I just want to like get settled a little bit and just stay in one place for a little bit longer than six months but yeah the time here has been really good like apart from <laughs> a few disagreements about money because as you know being self-employed and living in an expensive flat is very stressful but it's fine we got through it somehow and hopefully we're going to find somewhere for about half the price that we're paying here if maybe a little bit more uh, just need to try and find out where <laughs> that's the main issue hopefully it won't be too long so we're putting all of this sort of stuff we're putting it into storage self storage unit just for the time being just until we sort of have a bit of a better idea about where we're going to live and all that sort of stuff uh, so yeah I'm gonna and it's literally raining now you can see out my skylight sorry I'm not getting the very good angle it's literally pouring down so what a brilliant day to be packing we've already given up on packing and it's only been an hour i'm having some food nick's having egg on toast and i'm watching britain's got talent because i missed it yesterday because of the tv remote has been and gone somewhere so <laughs> don't know where that's gone but yeah so I can watch Britain's Got Talent so I'm watching it now and yeah having a bit of a break when we probably shouldn't be but it's okay. Nick would you like to tell my viewers about <clears throat> our little uh, coffee uh, experience earlier? It was a bad coffee. In Sainsbury's they cool. That's it. What was wrong with it? I asked for syrup and it didn't have any syrup. And uh I don't know if I'm ever gonna go back to <laughs> First world problems with Nicholas Shears. He's a bit of a coffee snob, like he uh he likes his coffee a certain way and if it's not like that he'll get a bit pissed off. Look how distraught he is, guys, look. He's absolutely devastated because it's coffee. It's kicking off, it's kicking off. Watching a bit of BGT. <laughs> really strong influence. <laughs> oh, Anne's still there as well. Oh, yeah. Oh, Simon's looking like a teapot. He's just in a teapot. Teapot? He's looking at a teapot. No, he was shaped like one. <laughs> he was shaped like a teapot. But well, he was doing something weird like that. Like this? <laughs> I don't know what you were doing. So it's like 
I don't know, a few hours after I last spoke to you and um, what have we been doing in the meantime Nick? What have we actually been doing? Watching YouTube aren't we? Yeah we just collapsed. And we, and we fell, oh it was so funny. We like fell at the side of the bed yeah. and playing around we both fell. We broke each other's arms. Yeah because we both ended up like uh, putting all our weight on each other's arms and literally almost had an accident. And I know it's bad, but you know, it's fine. We're having a pizza again. I think my third pizza this week, but you know, what do you what do you think on the matter, Nick? Was it your third? What do you think? I think it's like my fifth pizza of the week. Fifth? Fourth or fifth? It's not. It is. Fourth or fifth? Because, like, when did we last have Just Eat? Was it Monday? Tuesday. And then I've had two from Sainsbury's and another one, I think. So bad. But we are moving on Friday, so it's all good. It's all good. So waiting for our delivery now. We've got something on. Don't know what's on, but we're watching something. And yeah, just waiting for our feed. We haven't done any other packing today either. Why didn't you mention about how you're going to clean out there? You're bloody clean out there. <laughs> Basically, it's like, all well, this like, algae. I suppose it's like algae or lime scale or something. Like, out on the... <laughs> lime scale? <laughs> out on the balcony, and, uh... <laughs> out on the balcony, and Nick says I should clean it, even though he's, that's his job, really. But we haven't, we haven't done any cleaning. <laughs> we haven't done any cleaning whatsoever. <laughs> Or tied in up. <laughs> <laughs> you alright then, Nick? I'm not laughing at that, I'm sorry. Why? Lime scale. It didn't like me, lime scale. Hello, everyone. So, today it's now Tuesday. I did absolutely no packing yesterday. It was absolutely mad. But I am back on the packing front today. I did my work in the morning so I've got the whole afternoon to pack I think now it's like three o'clock though so <laughs> I had some lunch and all that good stuff and now I'm ready to pack and just in case you're wondering I thought I'd show you some things please ignore the shitty uh, <laughs> denim jacket it's literally the purpose to keep me warm I know it doesn't go at all with this outfit but you know that's just how I roll so focus focus I don't know if it's focusing. Focus, please. There we go. That's better. So, for today's outfit, I've got on a black velvet bodysuit, which looks like this. It's got like a really nice high neck. It's really pretty. I got it in Primark. And then I've got a pink and green and black sort of tart and skirt. And it's like sort of a bit sort of schoolgirl like I suppose but I really love it and then obviously got tights and my slippers this is just like you know a casual sort of day just packing and I sort of dress up to the nines that is literally how I roll today I'm literally just packing some of the stuff this is what we've got to contend with so we've got all that stuff on the bed of Nick's clothing then we've got all this on the floor which isn't great so that's what I'm going to be doing this afternoon just making sure that I get most of it done we've got the storage unit now so that's really good so it means we can start putting stuff in maybe tonight or tomorrow and it's 24 hours so we can go in any point if we need to and as well um with the storage unit they said that we're not going to be like you know hounded by people when we arrive which is really good because I hate when people I know they're only doing their job, but I hate when people come up to you and be like, oh, can I help you? And stuff like that. It's like, no. <laughs> I just want to get on and do my thing. I've got so much to do. I've got to sort out all my wardrobe because Nick wants to take it down because it's a flat pack. So I need to put it all, you know, in pieces to put in the storage unit. So that's going to be very fun. Another thing as well, when I was having my lunch, I was watching some of the Coachella highlights and it looked absolutely amazing. 
Beyonce like slayed though but sadly I was in Coachella I was here which is really sad I really hope I'll be able to go to Coachella one day it looks really really good it looks like the glam version of download <laughs> but obviously not rock music so much but yeah I'd love to go one day if I could but anyway so back to present tense I'm just gonna sort out some stuff I also still have some stuff on my Depop as well so I'll link that below or I'll also put like a little uh, la, 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 at thing somewhere here just so you can maybe even like check out my Depop shop if you want to buy anything. I'm thinking about adding a couple more things but I'm not entirely sure but I'm thinking about it or maybe just give it to charity shops just so it's not sort of there and like I just get rid of it really. I'm just trying to declutter my life really that's mainly what I'm trying to do. I'm just going to stop rambling and I'm going to get on with some packing. So in this bag we have an abundance of different shits. <laughs> Basically um, we've got some random floor, floor, floral, floral, floral lights that were in my office but since I haven't really had an office the last few months they've been stuck in that bag. I've just basically got like Christmas presents, I've got even some like Christmas wrapping stuff. Um, I haven't even got socks in it, you know, the usual. So that is like the miscellaneous bag, which I don't really know what to do with, but I think most of it's going to go in storage, to be honest. And so I've made a little bit of progress since you last saw me. I have, well, this doesn't look probably as bad or as good as I made out, but this is what the floor looks like now. So I've got rid of quite a lot of the rubbish that was on there to start with hey guys so it's quite a bit late now it's about eight o'clock something like that i think it's almost like 20 past eight we've had some feed i had what do i have i had a cheese and onion plat and then had some sweet potato mash and some carrots and nick had what was it? Garlic and mushroom escalops with veggies and potatoes because he's vegetarian so he had like corn. So the lighting's really bad. I had to film on my phone because my camera is so bad with the dark lighting so hope you don't mind. I just thought I'd update you on what sort of has happened in the time. The wardrobe is down <laughs> and we've replaced it with boxes that we need to fill up. Nick took down the whole of the wardrobe, which actually didn't take that long. Now there's like a massive space where the wardrobe used to be. We've got all the drawers out, everything like that. And they've all done. Yeah? Hello? I'm in here, I'm vlogging, mate. I'm vlogging. Please, can I have some chocolate? Please. I'll do anything. Nick, I don't know if I have any chocolate, mate. Walk around like a dog. He's going nuts. He's absolutely nuts. Oh! <laughs> so, yeah, in terms of the packing that's basically what we've done <laughs> what are you doing nook what are you actually doing okay we got all this stuff on the bed which we still haven't cleaned up have we nook it's all nick's clothes pretty much apart from a few of mine because obviously i need clothes to wear in the next few days before we move because we move on friday and today is tuesday so there isn't actually that much stuff in my wardrobe left but the stuff is on the bed so i can't actually get into bed and chill until all this is moved so we've done the wardrobe sorry i'm literally like rambling we've done the wardrobe i've packed quite a few boxes i know what i'm taking home sort of thing and um Can I bite his head off? no i got that as a present nick's trying to eat my bunny my used bunny but He's trying to go for it. He's actually trying to eat it. No. We're definitely not done, but we're definitely getting there. As well, I just thought, I think I'm going to put, like, 
the videos in like one whole video because I don't think there's enough for like two moving vlogs or and I just don't I don't know I think I don't know let me know what you think I get bored like watching two moving vlogs I'd rather have it all in one but let me know what you think because I can make it in short videos if you'd prefer because I love a good old vlog that's really long oh that wasn't a great angle I'm gonna have a walk but it turned out we literally went a little bit through the door and then turned back because it was too cold I was complaining because it was too cold um even though it's probably about 14 degrees now because it's now British summertime Hello everyone, so today is Thursday and today we are actually moving everything out to the storage unit so like the furniture and just like all the clothes and stuff that we want to put in storage so it's going to be a long day we've got the van now, it's parked outside, it's a big boy van, it's a big ass van so uh, yeah Ooh, today is going to be a very busy day so we've both had to take a day off work to pack and well, just to finish packing up some storage as well as actually putting it in the bloody storage unit. So today I'm wearing, <laughs> this is really, really bad because I can't even show you in the mirror anymore. It's like this sort of like Mustang sort of inspired top. This is from Primark that I got in the sale, I think. It was really cool. And then I've just got my checkered jeans. I got these actually from one of my friends. So, yeah, that was a nice little gift. I think they're from Band Apparel, but I think they probably stock them in Blue Banana, but obviously they're quite old, so I don't know if they'll still be there. And then this jacket I got from TK Maxx, it's got like loads of tassels. I look like an actual cowgirl, which is definitely the aesthetic you want to have when you move out. But yeah, I love it so much. So that's my outfit. I've just got some pumps as well. I don't know if you've ever seen them. I just got them as a birthday present or Christmas present like ages ago from my nan so I'm wearing those and yeah we've got so much to do today we had well we woke up early because our landlord was coming over just to kind of go through the whole moving out process and then we went down to collect the van had some breakfast and now is the time to move everything into the van to the storage unit so this will be very very fun <laughs> I'm going to take you along with me today uh, yeah, and just show you the sort of moving process of putting stuff into a storage unit if any of you actually care. <laughs> so I'll see you in a little bit. So it's like a few hours later now. Um, we've been to storage once, storage once, <laughs> storage unit once, and we're absolutely shattered. There was like a whole van to unload, and there's like a bit of a walk to the unit as well, so absolutely knackered. But we've still got like loads more to fit in the unit, but the issue is the unit is <laughs> probably a little bit too small. Um, so we're kind of debating whether or not to stick to a normal unit, you know, like the one we've got now, or upgrade it, which means taking everything out of the unit. And so, uh, yeah, we're pretty sad. We just had like a little lunch break, and uh, yeah, we're pretty knackered now. We've literally got a few more bits that we think about putting in the storage unit. But the thing is, we don't even know if we're able to get it in. So we're trying to think what to do. Might even have to take some bits home. Just to, you know, make sure that we can actually have them. Because we've got nowhere else to put them. It's so hot today. Probably the worst day ever to move stuff out. Because it's probably about 20, I think it's like 23 degrees here. So it's so, so hot. And... Moving like heavy furniture in this is absolute agony. <laughs> like honestly, it's so, so much hassle and oh, the amount of sweat. Oh, <laughs> you just don't want to know. It's not actually taken as long as I thought because we actually finished. We sort of finished the first load at two. So it's now three, so we've had a bit of a break. And now we're just going to crack on, see how much we can get into the unit. But we've still got loads of packing to do like for tomorrow because that's when my parents are coming. Cause I'm gonna go home with them, so I need to actually <laughs> pack for that as well, which I really won't feel like doing. So I might just need that till tomorrow because they probably won't be here till lunchtime. So yeah, exciting. I might even show you a little sneak peek of the storage unit if you're lucky. Great quality content. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way, th this might not interest anyone, but for my lunch day, I had a tuna sandwich and 
I had, I think they're quite they're new, the mini cheddars, the red Leicester ones, but this is not a sponsor. <laughs> I'm not popular enough to have a sponsor video, so don't even think that I'm sponsoring anyone, or no one's a sponsor of me rather. But yeah, the red Leicester mini cheddars are sick, they're really nice. <laughs> so if anyone's into mini cheddars, they are the way to go. Anyway, I'm trembling, so I need to just tape up a few more boxes and get going. So this is what a storage unit looks like. I don't know if you'll be able to see because it's um a little bit bright, but it's literally pretty much packed up. Go on then, off you go. This will be good footage as well. Yeah. Oh. See if you can lock it, Nick. <laughs> Had a bit of trouble, didn't we, the first time yeah. doing this, so hopefully it works as well. We just Success. locked it, didn't we, Nick? We did, indeed. Locked it. After literally about a few minutes of trial and error, we've actually done it. We are on our way home, aren't we, Nick? Yeah. Has that been a good day for you? Exhausting. It has, hasn't it? It's been really exhausting. I need a beer. This is quite tricky, actually, looking at it like this. It's really is weird. It? Yeah. It's really quite freaky. Big boys, Jolly fans. Big boy van, the big boy van. <laughs> you do the code? No. <laughs> Go on, Nick. So I won't show you the code. Because, you know. There's the bay doing the code. And he doesn't know I'm filming. <laughs> Still has absolutely no idea I'm filming. But it's all good. This is so weird. Like, there's no one else, like, here. Ah. Oh. Gate's not opening. The gate's not opening now. This is just our luck, really. But it's weird because there's like no one else in the storage unit, so it means at least we've got to try and figure out this all ourselves, which could be interesting, but to say the least, because the gate is not opening, and Nick's typed the right code and everything, I think, but um, it's not opening, so this could be very, very fun. We literally just got that gate to open, haven't we now? Oh, it's forever. The gate is opening. We literally thought we were going to get out then, didn't we now? <laughs> Buckled up. In the... BB... I am in... BBVE. The uh, middle seat. Yeah, BBVE. Big boy van experience. <laughs> Off we go. Oh, Nick. Do the handbrake, mate. Oh, it's not... Oh, yeah. <laughs> Nick's been having a bit of issues with the sound break. Yeah, sound really, really low. Low, low. Low, low, low. Mm, mm, really, really, really low. Low, low, oh, low, no, no. <laughs> I stole it, mummy. Bloody stole it, mate. <laughs> Bloody stole it. There you go. We're off. <laughs> that did not sound good at all. Really didn't. Run away. This is Avon Mouth, for everyone, if no one has seen it before. Never it's see it uh, a bit of a sight. I mean, it's literally just full of industrial places and lorries and bug vans, as you can see over here. Yeah, yeah. yeah li probably more than a thousand though. There's quite a lot of industrial estates here. Probably not the ideal holiday destination, but uh, I mean, it might. I'm actually going on holiday. <laughs> might might suit somebody here. Yeah. Hello everyone, so it is Friday now. We have had a busy morning packing. I think it's around half nine now. And we both woke up like just before seven and we were so tired because we had such a busy day moving everything yesterday. We finished at about five. What was it, four? Four or five, yeah, I think it was five. So we had such a busy day yesterday and today we just spent, well so far we just spent like moving stuff into the van, packing extra stuff. My parents are going to get here in about an hour and a half, so that'll be really exciting. I haven't seen them in so long. Um, so obviously they're going to help me take some of my stuff home. And I'm going to stay with them for a few weeks until we decide where we're going to live and stuff. Oh, it looks so bloody empty. I mean, 
there's still some bits in here but it's getting very very minimal now so yeah it's very 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 minimal uh, we haven't actually eaten yet or drunk anything because we've been so busy just trying to make sure that everything is done. I want to film like a sort of empty apartment tour as well before my parents arrive. So it means we've got like an hour and a half to get everything out because we've pretty much packed everything now so that's really good. So I don't know how much footage I'm actually going to film today mainly because I just don't want to film with my parents just because you know family time and stuff so I don't want to like shove a camera in the faces I don't think they'd appreciate that anyway so yeah so we're literally just packing up the rest of my stuff I'm pretty much wearing the same outfit as yesterday apart from my top which is from TK Maxx and it's got like a little babe love heart thing going on pretty much the same outfit though and my tummy is rumbling so much but I can't even eat anything it's depressing not really much else to update you on yesterday night we slept on a blow up bed and it was amazing it was a bit uncomfortable though i had to keep tossing and turning so i'm pretty gonna show you more footage of packing and cheers and loading stuff up and then vlog on home hello everyone so i just got home i think it took about three hours overall so it wasn't too bad of a journey i'm really sorry i didn't vlog anything it's really funny like vlogging in front of your parents is just like oh and like I think my mum's got a pretty good idea I make videos but I don't think my dad does so it's sort of like oh I can't really like get my camera out and start filming so I'm now in my old bedroom so yeah the trip was fairly good we didn't get held up but my but Nick he got held up so much on the way home I think he caught a lot of the work traffic so that was so unfortunate for him but he is home now as well so it's all good and we're seeing each other next week yeah next weekend so that'd be really nice so it's not like it's gonna be long before i see him again thankfully i hope you enjoyed this vlog and i hope it wasn't too much of a mix match of stuff and hopefully it was still enjoyable though <laughs> if you like this video please remember to give it a like that'd be really helpful or a thumbs up rather maybe even subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of me because i post a new video every saturday morning at 9am even like leave a comment maybe about like your moving experience or if you're moving at the moment because i don't know about you but i really like enjoy doing moving vlogs i find them really good content so i'd love to like know about everyone else's moving experiences maybe if they're a vlogger and they've done moving vlogs i'd love to watch it especially like smaller creators i feel like everyone needs a bit of a help recently i'd love to be linked to some of your moving vlogs or similar content down below if you wish to show me it maybe even hit the bell if you would like to be notified when i post because it's incredibly hard now to be seen so i'll see you next week guys Bye.